Hey guys, today we'll be checking out a new app called Phone7Market. So we'll post a link to download this in the blog post. So once you download and install it, you will need a unlocked Windows phone. And you should connect your phone via the USB cable to your PC. And Zone should be up and running as well. And there should be no lock screen on your phone. So once you start the app, you can search for any app that you want. So it will only show free apps that are available on the marketplace. So if you search for the Amazon app, it will show you all the Amazon apps from the marketplace. And currently it's looking at the AU region, which is Australia. And if you want to switch that over to US, you'll see that the Amazon.com app will come up. So if you switch it back to Australia, so you'll see that the Amazon.com app won't be there. The Kindle will still be there. So if you want to install the Amazon.com app, you can select that, double click it, it'll bring it up. It'll show you the screenshots, you can check the reviews which might come up. It'll give you the description and screenshot, the reviews, it doesn't come up for some reason. And then you can save this app to your PC or you can deploy it straight away. So as you can see I don't have the Amazon.com app on this device but we will try and install it using Phone 7 Marketplace. And if you click deploy. So I've selected the launch after install option and I'm deploying the app from the Phone 7 Market and that is sending the file to the device now and that has installed the app. And as you can see now the Amazon app has come up. And if you jump out and go into the marketplace, you'll see that the Amazon.com app is now present on your phone. And so that is. And there you have it. So it installed the Amazon.com app. And you should be able to use it. And this should work for any free apps from the marketplace. It will not give you paid apps, so you cannot use this for pirated apps and you cannot use this to install OEM specific apps as well so if you want to install like a Samsung app on an HTC device unfortunately you cannot do that using this method and so that's all thanks for watching